Hello 12th standard students. A camera is accidentally knocked off an edge of a cliff 400 feet high. This is a cliff. This is a camera. This camera is a little bit. This camera is a little bit. Now, this a cliff. This is a part. This is a camera. This is a camera. This is a camera. This is a ground light. Falls at a distance of s is equal to first number s is equal to 16 t square. I've been sort of in t seconds. How long does the camera fall? How long? You know, time at the before it hits the ground. Tarai lavandu parathuke, you know, time at the kitchen. Ingarandi inga the travel I were the ingarandi inga travel I were the Varathuke, you know, time archi sort of ketraganga. Actually, you can see the distance of the cliff is 400 feet high. This is 400 feet. Then the camera is traveled. 400 feet is traveled. The distance traveled by camera is 400. The first subdivision start. First, how long is it? It's given the distance traveled by camera is 400. The distance traveled by the camera is 400. This is the same substitute. Given that S is equal to 16t square, we will substitute. Then we will get 16t square is equal to 400. But t square is equal to 400 by 16. Right term. 4 tables cancel. 100. This is 4 times. This cancel. 25. Then t square is equal to 25. But t is equal to square root of thing, plus or minus number one time under the your answer is 5. Let me seconds lower than 5 seconds. Up actually in 5 seconds, correct anje second le camera on the anger reach item ground le reach item. Okay, wa. for how long it takes na t is equal to 5 seconds. First sum is over into the second part of the sum. Second part of the sum to get to go, what is the average velocity with which the camera falls during the last two seconds? For last two seconds, Patina. This is first, this is second, this is third, this is four, this is five. Fifth second is the last two seconds. Last two seconds, we will consider this second and this second. How is it? Actually, five minus three gives two seconds. That is the last two seconds. Last one second is four to five. Four is the five transfer of one second. Last two seconds is the last two seconds. Five minus three is the two. Okay, that is the last two seconds. So, this is our A and this is our B. So, we call it average velocity. Average velocity is the formula. The formula goes like this. S of B minus S of A by B minus A. If we have a number, S of B and S of 5 minus S of A and 3. S of 3. By B minus A and 5 minus 3. If you subtract, you will have 2. Then you will have 2 seconds. If you have 2 seconds in the denominator, then 2 seconds. If you have 4 or 5, you will have 1. Then you will have the last 2 seconds in the concept. Last 2 seconds in the denominator, 2. Now, S of 5. Then you will have S. Then you will have 5 substitute. T is 5 substitute. Then 16 into 5 square. 16 into 5 square. Minus 16 into 3 square. Into 3 square. You will be getting 16 into 25, 16 into 25 minus, minus, minus 16 into 9 by 2. For 16 into 25, you will be getting 400, 400 minus, minus 16 into 9, 144, all divided by 2. The minus is 6, this is 9, 9 is 4, 5 is 5. இது 3 ஆயிடும் 3 இல்ல 1 போச்சு நான் 2 by 2 இது divide பண்ணிக்கு நான் 1 times 2 times 8 times meter meter கடையே sorry feet feet per second therefore your average velocity will be 128 feet per second after finishing this average velocity third question is instantaneous velocities instantaneous velocity அப்படினாலே differentiation instantaneous velocity third part we are entering into instantaneous velocity instantaneous velocity அப்படின் கேட்டாலே v is equal to s dash t s dash t s dash t ஒரு வாட்டி differentiate பண்ணனும் இவுரை differentiate பண்ணனும் அப்போ v is equal to v is equal to அது differentiate பண்ணிக்கினா 2 முன்னுடி பேடும் 16 into 2 
t2 minus 1. Mala gurda one minus pan differentiation pan in a gurda. Apo 32t is the instantaneous velocity. Along in a kitagana, when it hits the ground, it's the ground, a tarela podomo, tarela podomo time pagano, time on the 5. Apo 5 at me is subshit panano. For when t is equal to 5, when t is equal to 5, instantaneous velocity is equal to. Instantaneous velocity is equal to 32 into 5. 32 into 5. So you will be getting 160 feet per second. And velocity is allowed per second. So your answer will be 160 feet per second. Okay. Thank you. Divisible.